happening of physical death happening of present dying and becoming past happening of new birth and happening of future being born all this happens in same frequency and the cognition with which you operate your life if you think very immature powerless way in binary logic way about your death and birth past and future you will live a superficial life anyone gets a matured cognition about the death birth past and future lives a powerful enlightened life enlightenment does not need any spiritual practice it only needs spiritual enlightening from proper guru it is only a right cosmic legal opinion being digested and manifested listen carefully enlightenment does not need any spiritual practice this is directly from paramashiva it only needs a spiritually enlightening cosmic legal opinion from a enlightened incarnation and you digesting it that's all listen how can paramashiva say you don't need spiritual practice that is true all our spiritual practice is just to detox us it has nothing to do with none of the spiritual practices can give enlightenment they only can detox your system and keep you receptive so when guru pours energy powerful cognition just hold it and manifest it if you think in the language of binary logic cheap immature powerless cognitions the people who want to keep you as a slave most of the so called developed countries are large scale prisons where you just concur with the whole system established and you just go with it you you are born you go to the school and you take up a job you pay your bills by the time you are paying your bills life is gone maybe a marriage a divorce and kids and custody and and kids few christmas few vacation and few sight seeing maybe a little time for religion and a little time for being sick and you are gone 